Hey guys, welcome back to All On Law. Today we're gonna talk about the what are the what you call the latest update regarding Ebola, viral disease. This is really very fatal disease. Okay, there has been an outbreak in the Western Africa, like the Liberia, some part of the Nigeria, Guinea, right? So we're gonna talk about today. So is there any drug? Okay, is there any drug that is available? to treat what you call the Ebola virus disease. So to begin with, uh, there has been what you call a recent uh, launch of a new drug that is known as ZMAP. Okay, with the, what you call ZMAP uh, biopharmaceutical company of US, okay. Um, this ZMAP, well, it was initially used in what you call uh, when two U.S. citizens were infected with this Ebola virus in while working in what you call Liberia. So, when this ZMAP was given, the, the what you call the both the U.S. citizens recovered from that uh, infection, the Ebola viral disease. Okay, so. But the problem with this drug is uh, the ZMAP. ZMAP is um, actually it has never been used on humans before, and this was the first case where they used the ZMAP and it worked. Okay, and this ZMAP previously it was used in monkeys, monkeys infected with monkeys infected with what you call the the Ebola virus Ebola virus and they completely recovered and that's what you call that was the one that was the reason that why they used this ZMAP on a human being okay but since it has never been used before there's no clinical trials on that randomized control trial on that that's why they are really what you call they don't know the side effects of that. That's why they're using very cautiously uh, and they're what you call they're hesitating to use this drug on human beings. Right, guys? So this ZMAP is derived from ZMAP is derived from what you call a tobacco plant that is grown in Australia. Okay? But remember the drug is being made by the US. That's why the, tr the these plants were grown more in uh, what you call Arizona. Arizona. Okay, and uh, the what you call the ZMAP was extract, extracted from this tobacco plant. What they did was uh, they injected what you call um, this uh, to plant tobacco plant with Ebola virus. Okay, tobacco plant with Ebola virus. And when the when this plant started producing what you call the antibodies against this Ebola virus then they extracted that serum okay they extracted that serum from this tobacco plant which has produced antibodies against ebola virus so they extracted this serum and injected in monkeys and hence this serum killed what you call the ebola virus in monkeys okay since these what you call the antibodies present in the serum were taken from the, what you call uh, again the what what they did initially and later it was also taken from what you call the mice which was infected with this uh, Ebola okay and the drug was uh, the serum was produced with this so that's why it's also known as what you call three mouse monoclonal antibody mixture three mouse monoclonal what is monoclonal antibodies if the antibodies are produced from what you call the the similar monoclonal then it is called single then it's called as a what you call uh, monoclonal antibodies if it's produced from many what you call antibodies then it's known as uh, polyclonal okay from many genes right so this is what the definition of um, monoclonal antibodies is right guys so this is what uh, this what you call the ZMAP works and since we don't know what you call the, the side effects, no clinical trials has been done before 
that's why it is not being advised to use in human beings okay guys so this is the reason and another thing is there is a new drug that has been that is being developed by the what you call Tecmira company pharmaceutical company okay Tecmira uh, a US based company okay but it is under the phase 1 clinical trial okay phase 1 clinical trial so this is going to be the brief information as we wait for some more time we will get a mechanism of action of each drug of this drug how does it act and whether it's effective or not okay on uh, some other drugs maybe some vaccines in future we're going to get the vaccines against ebola because ebola is really very fatal why because it's it's going to kill 10 9 patients out of 10 patients so it's really very fatal guys that's why this drug is what you call um, there is under what you call we have to make a drug for that and a vaccine would be very great okay guys so thank you so much for watching this video i'm sure uh this video has guided you or given you some information regarding the zmap and some uh, new drugs from some other company of us okay we'll be waiting for some new other drugs or mechanism of action days and uh, the side effects the clinical trial results of these drugs in future okay guys till then take care